I'm a real doctor, Dr. Realman. See, I've got a poster and a... A dog trap! Show the slide. Don't look This isn't oh, a sunburn! Really? Okay. What is she doing? Well, that's, well not that's not natural. Well, well, at least you look pretty and pink. No, but what do you say? Are you willing to take me on as a patient? It's not so much my... I can't... Okay. Dr. Runner, I'm sorry. These are so oh, finicky. Oh, oh, oh. I think we should take a closer look at your external organs. Internal. Internal organs. It's an external. I think... We should form a coronary angiography. A coronal arthropod. A coronary angiography. Oh, right. So the procedure seems to be going fine. It looks, everything looks normal. Plasma flow is good. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So that color change does indicate a problem. But we know that. What kind of problem? Is it good or bad? It seems to be running smoothly. Hey, but wait. This scan, the colors are off. Are we watching the weather channel? Not just shapes, those are letters. Are we playing hangman? Oh, wait, wait, wait. A T. No, no, no. It has to be about E. It's getting more clear. Well, that means it can only be one thing. Wait, abstract finger painting syndrome? I got it! Okay, Miss Morris. I, I mean, we have come up with the diagnosis. So, what we think you have is a dual brain and heart condition. It's very rare. So, what's it called? What we think you have is called YMCA. I do DI because I like making people laugh. Uh, I do DI because my, my parents signed me up for it. <laughs> <laughs> I do DI because it makes me happy. I do DI because I have a crush on all the boys here. Uh, I do DI because my, my parents signed me up for it. So like, you know, I guess I have to raise money now. Yo, I do DI because I want to be on the high side, yo. Oh my gosh. Cut me off guard. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Dog. <laughs> okay. Uh, I do DI because my parents signed me up for it. So like, you now I gotta go to meetings like once a week and stuff. So, you know, but that, there's that, I guess. <laughs> Mr. Silver and Pop. Yo, Da Vinci, how you doing, my man? I've been good, good, but I've been low. Yeah, I'm all kind of figure out that chicks really don't dig wires. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, you'd think chicks would dig a flying machine. Sure, it didn't fly, but it's a concept. <laughs> <laughs> I don't really know anything about girls, so like, you know. And you're asking me. Third point. So it's all in Ronnie and. Oh, hey, boys. <laughs> <laughs> what are you two fine specimens? <laughs> <laughs> Having a good old dinner out at the dinner place? <laughs> She's being too modest. We're here to pick up boys. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you get your number? <laughs> okay, what, what do you mean by like, like how old we are? Like, yeah, like your phone number. Right, right, right. right, right, yeah, yeah. right. How about you give us yours? Uh, yeah. What's a number? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Maybe, maybe. Hello, Verizon. Ring, 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 ring. Oh, do something. Do not. Okay. Okay. Wrong voice. Right. Yo, you've reached out uh, Medieval Verizon and helped me take your order. Uh, <laughs> we're, we're trying to pick a chance so and they gave us our number. Can you, can you help us out with that? Oh, yo, I totally got you. You need like a phone plan or something? Yes. Okay. Hey, hey, hey it's Ronnie. Look, you're on. <laughs> Hi, Ronnie. So. We got some ladies that are in the uh, house and gave us a phone number. Say no more. I got right. it. All right. Thank you, so what you're looking for is 25 calls per year. That'll hold you back for the next 10 years, okay? Okay.
therefore, I'm not a part of this game, therefore I have not committed this crime. Then, Tate, why are you here? This box is falling apart. I'm the only thing holding it together. I have to be here. Can I help? No, 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 it seems to be a clue. A clue. Hmm, what does it say? This clue will help you pocket the mystery. <laughs> Did you know that Anthony E. Pratt created this game in World War II for the soldiers' have entertainment? He, he wanted there to be ten weapons, and his wife was the one who created the rooms. The weapons were, let's see, a syringe, a rope, a lead pipe, and some other really cool weapons. Remember to press the button. Wait, this random ghost. <laughs> I'm Envelope. I've been hiding these clues for them. Tape killing Mr. Pratt was just not acceptable. This game isn't the same without one. <laughs> 